The Nigerian Medical Association Enugu State Branch has suspended its chairman, Dr. Ike Okwisili, for alleged gross misconduct and abuse of office. The association appointed a deputy vice chairman, Dr. Yekachi Ugwonye, to act as chairman pending the determination of the matter by the Ethics and Disciplinary Committee of the NMA State Branch. A statement on Saturday in Enugu signed by Ogunye said that the meeting attended by several members of the association was in line with the bylaws of the NMA in Enugu State. He said that the suspension of Okwesili was aimed at improving the efficiency of the association and placed it on a better pedestal for greater service. Reacting on the suspension, Dr. Okwesili said that the purported suspension was politically motivated and unconstitutional. He described the action as the manifestation of the rascality which is creeping into the medical profession. He alleged that they want to have their way because the election is coming up in two weeks' time. And joining us now is Dr. Onyeka Chugwe, the acting chairman of the NMA Enugu branch. Thank you very much for joining us, sir. Thank you. Good morning. Good morning to you. According to the suspended chairman, he believes that you are an usurper and his removal is politically motivated. Can you please explain what the association means by gross misconduct? Well, thank you very much. Um... I'm a product of a properly constituted um, emergency general meeting of the Congress of Nigerian Medical Association, Enugu State Chapter. By gross misconduct and um, disregard to the bylaw guiding the association, is that the suspended NMA chairman unilaterally truncated a properly constituted um, state executive council meeting that um, had the opportunity of discussing pressing issues about the welfare of members of the state NMA who um, stand chances of losing their rights and privileges as it regards the forthcoming NMA election that will uh, usher in new executive members that will lead the association for the next two years. So members frown at this, and every effort made to get the NMA, suspended NMA chairman to give audience to the issues and then involve stakeholders to resolve the matter, prove their body. So uh, it's unfortunate that he's describing it yeah. and as a um, poorly consulted and calling me a usurper of uh, an office. How, how true is the allegation that the suspension has uh, so much to do with the upcoming election? Well, it could be true, it could be false. If we understand that the Sosene NMA chairman had grand plan disqualifying members of NMA from participating in the forthcoming election, yes, I would say it has a relationship. But beyond that, there is no direct connection between the suspension and uh, the election. It's all about an act that members of NMA frown at. Okay, and then why can't the, if you, if you say the elections are, you know, uh, forthcoming, and pretty soon, I believe, why can't the association just wait to vote him out if he's indeed guilty, as alleged, and an investigation, you know, conducted after, you know, the, his office? Um, I, can, I can hear you very well. I'm asking, if, 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 we, if you are saying that the elections are coming pretty soon, and that's what you're preparing for, why can't the association wait to vote him out instead, if he's indeed guilty as alleged? Well, the truth is that the NMA bylaw and national constitution prohibit uh, an officer from contesting a second time. So he is not contesting. That's the truth. And uh, the Congress of NMA cannot watch a sitting chairman of NMA who has the mandate of the Congress be vindictive and uh, disqualify members from participating in the election. If, the, if he is allowed to have his way, that means that these people will not have the opportunity to exercise their franchise until two years from now. So it will not be an appropriate thing to do. And lastly, let me also ask, how healthy is this for the profession? It's not very usual that uh, people hear of doctors having this type of disagreement. So, you know, how much damage might this do to the profession? Quite unfortunate. 
we'll regret the situation that um, we we'll found ourselves. But every effort has been made to avert this situation, if not for the recalcitrant attitude of the suspended NMA chairman, who refused to heed the voices of reasoning. Uh, but we are hopeful that um, we will come out of this stronger and better united NMA. Thank you very much, uh, Dr. Onyekachi Ugoonye, the acting chairman of the NMA Inugu State Force, speaking with us. And uh, we would likely bring you in again. Thank you very much.